Today, a Nebraska Woodster, we're gonna bust our ash. Here we go. Hey Woodsters, my name is Mike. Welcome back everybody. So today, we got ourselves a load of ash from our tree project we did down on the school property. And so the first side dump loads have started to come in here. And so pretty nice side dump load of ash here. And so we are going to start bucking that up. So we were working into that locust pile here in previous uh, videos. And so now we've got a load of ash here and kind of excited. We haven't uh, ran any ash through the Wolf Ridge yet. So today we're going to bust our ash and uh, get that bucked up. And I think we'll probably bring over the glacier, break down these big rounds, and then get them over to the splitter. So got a couple other thoughts around uh, how we load that wolf ridge. I've got uh, the tractor up there that uh, is needing to be started again and see uh, if we could just put the snow bucket on there. Should be able to hold quite a bit, be able to get it right up to the wolf ridge and uh, get it split up. So anyway, yeah, nice load of ash, some big stuff in there. I did uh, get the saw fixed, so we're going to give that thing a whirl on some of this big stuff here and see if uh, see how that works. So, all right, well, time to work our ash off. Here we go. Also, should mention uh, as we uh, get into the middle of August here, still like to beat the sun up. We uh, starting to cool off nicely in the evenings and in the mornings. So, good wood wood yard working weather. So. We uh, supposed still supposed to get up to the mid 90s today, but beautiful working out here as long as you get your butt out of bed. So, anyway, all right, enough yapping. Here we go.
bigger stuff chunked up. So a little bit of smaller stuff here. We'll break out the uh, 450 Husqvarna and uh, cut up some of the smaller stuff and save the chain on the big uh, on the big saw. So when we get into some more big stuff, still cut straight. All right, there we go.
Well, we busted our ash this morning. Good, nice little pile there. One thing uh, I learned is that uh, when you run a 52cc saw and then you jump up to a 92cc saw, you know exactly why you bought that thing. And then going back to the 52 feels like it's taking forever, but gotta let them do some cool down. So we've got a pretty nice little pile going here. Should make a lot of nice firewood, a lot of gray, straight grain stuff there. And so ashes cash is what they say. So anyway, nice little uh, session here this morning. So you guys know the program, like, subscribe and share. Thanks for the supporting the channel and we'll see you on the flip side.